Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Prime, and welcome back to another ProJude video. Yay! So, last time we left off, I was collecting stones, showing you how to make some money. Some fast money. Um, I don't know that it's the best way to make money, but I've also not really experimented with, like, how fast I can get the stone versus how fast I can get it back, how much you're going to make, stuff like that. I will make more videos on how to do that, but what I wanted to do right now is, if you look behind me, right here, this is all appetite. The, uh, the stone that I use. Hello! Thank you so much for the subscribe. Appreciate it. So right th here are all the appetite stone furnaces. All right, you have your gold, you got your iron, you got your aluminum, you got your copper, and you got your tin, okay? So these are all five irons, uh, so these are all five metals with the appetite stone. The reason I used appetite is because right now it is the, the most valued stone inside the game because it appears only in the tundra. You can only chop so much of it. Um, the other thing that might make this different is marble. And I think shice, Sh shice, shice, Sh whatever the, the other stone is, they're, they're kind of rare as well. And I think marble appears only at random. So it, it's kind of like the ebony tree of the stone world. Um, this is kind of like the lava wood of the stone world. Um, it's usually in the same place. It's usually in the, the same tundra area and it's always in the north. Just like the lava trees are always on the volcano, always in the south, on uh, in, in the specific realm. And it's also going to be very specific to which world you're in. Why is it getting dark again? Why is it always dark in here? Is it going dark? Yeah, it's going dark. Oh, man. Uh, that's okay. I will show you. Um, this is kind of cool. I am still building up on my base a bit. But look at look at the outside. I put these... these Torches. Oh, oh, I still gotta build those. Uh, I was making them out of ten, right? So it should only take me two more tens. Two tens. Get it? That's funny. Hey, while I'm over here, let's just go ahead and do that. Um, let's do a three. Let's do a B. Come on. Switch over to the three. There you go. B. And I want a wall. Oh, where is it? Wall torch. Yes, thank you. So now I need to put it place. If I looked um, from the top stone of the wall, it's down one stone and in the middle. Top stone of the wall, down one and in the middle. Rotate, 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 rotate. Just like that. And day cycle, yes. Finish. You can turn them into manual, which is kind of cool. So you can like turn it on and off. Um, kind of like what I did with the um, the torch on. Or the the hanging lamp on top of the uh, the thing. Here, I'll show you in a second. This right here, this is my outside wall, so far, and it looks amazing. It looks awesome. I I can't wait to have this finished. Um, right here, this is my foundation. This is where I'm going to be building the uh, the floor, the main floor of Code Primate Labs, and then this down here. This is what's actually set to auto. Or not auto. This is what's set to manual, because this is like the original ebony crafting table that the magic happened on. The dupe. <laughs> uh, you can turn this. Oh wait. I thought I turned this to. Uh... Oh oh oh. Hold on. Get this out of my hands. There we go. Switch to three. Can I click on it? No, but I can grab it. Oh my gosh, that was kind of cool. What? I didn't know you could grab onto those. Can you do that inside the uh, the lighthouse? Hold on, how do I... Calm you down, calm down. Calm. There you go. There you go. Now, how do I cycle this on or off? Oh, it's got a Roblox symbol on it. Look at that. Oh, by the way. Notice the sound. It's kind of like an ambient outside sound. I don't know if you can hear it or not in the video. Here. Okay, that was somebody like building something. But if I come outside, watch. As soon as I pass outside, I 
I hope I like the the there's ambience sounds to running outside. There's also ambient sounds to your camera going under the water. By the way, I'll let you I'll let you figure out what that says. <laughs> oh, oh gosh, oh, I was running out of breath. Okay, so what was I talking about? <clears throat> oh, the whole point of the video is to measurements, uh, the, the measurements of things. So what I'm using right now is copper as my base. Um, each, each metal has a different smelting time per different um, furnace that you're using. And it's abundantly clear once you actually test this. Um, let's head into here. I'm just going to bust out some wood. All right. Now, what I have to do, I've already got copper. I don't know if you can see that. Can you see it very well? Oh, gosh. Hold on. Let's go to Roblox. Right click. Filters. Nighttime filter. Nighttime. Daytime. Okay, so I've got the filters on there. You can just barely see it. But it's all filled with copper, so we're going to open this up. Now, the way I measure, okay, I usually do this. I open up my clock on my phone, and inside the clock, there's a thing called a stopwatch. I don't know if you can see it or not, right there. If you hit start on the stopwatch, it starts measuring, right? Or it's, it starts timing. If you hit lap, it'll take that particular point in time and keep going. So each one could be considered a lap. Okay, so the way I'm doing this, we reset the whole thing, is I'm going to start burning the wood and start my timer. Each time I see one of these go, right, and it spits out, I'm going to hit lap. And then on the very last one, when it goes, I'm going to hit stop, and that should be all my times for each copper for the whole thing. Now, what you can do is you can fill it up, burn it all, and then stop the timer on the very last one. And you take that number divided by 12. Uh, wait. Eight. Divided by 12. You can only put 12 into a furnace at a time. So therefore, whatever the total number is, divided by 12 should be your average. The numbers that we've posted on our project page, our project wiki, they are averages, okay? They're not exact numbers. One board is not gonna burn the exact same amount every single time. It's gonna have this variance to it. The other part to this is, I don't know if the type of wood you're putting into the furnace affects the type of smelt that you're gonna get. I know it affects the, the burn time, but the smelting is what we're interested in. So right now, um, if I go back and look for gold, uh, and by the way, I did all this in Excel sheets whenever I was first doing it. So right now, for the gold appetite, a copper burns about every 30 seconds. Um, total burn time was six minutes and five seconds to get the whole thing burnt. Six minutes, five seconds. So you take that uh, by its averages of six divided by 12, you get 30 seconds. I think. Something like that. And again, it's an estimation. It's not an exact value. But this is also going to be the closest that we're going to get. Because you have to measure things based on what you know. So when you first approach a furnace... What do we know about it? We know that we can press E to open it up. We can press E to place wood into the furnace. We can uh, approach it with iron or with a, an ingot and it'll say um, smelt and you can place it in there. That's it. That's the only things that we know. Uh, oh, and the fact that we can build it with different materials, different stones, different irons. Uh, I keep saying irons different stones and different metals to produce different kinds of furnaces. Um, the reason I used appetite on all of these is as a control. I wanted to make sure appetite was the same across all of the different things. That way the measurements are done. By the way, before I get started on actually burning this stuff, I wanted to say uh, 
I saw the other uh, the Wikia guys doing this. I think Soap is doing this as well. So we're gonna have um, two consistent measurements. I believe they're they're testing stone right now. I'm testing the just the metals, but we both built about the same time, which was ironic because we we're like I was building, and then I came over and I, I jumped up here just to kind of say hi and hey what's up, and he was building. I'm like, dude, are you doing the the test? He's like, yeah. <laughs> yeah I think I weirded him out a little bit. So, uh, yeah, here you are, small. How do I get up to your stuff? There we go. Up, 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 up. Go out this door. I just want to show this off real quick. Booyah! Look at that. He's testing all... Uh, wait, I think this is all tin. I can't see in here very well. But this is all tin, and he's testing the different stones. Appetite, the... the Pretty? Pretty? Per, perte? Neat? I don't remember what this one's called. Uh, and then that one's marble. That one's limestone. Don't know. Uh, granite. Shice. I don't know what those are. That's limestone. That's got to be slate. So he needs sandstone. I think. I can't see the colors. That might be sandstone. This might be limestone. What he needs. But they are all tin, so he's testing the stones. Oh, do, 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 do. By the way, I, we are we highly believe that the stones control the speed that the wood burns. And again, the type of wood that you use in your furnace could possibly alter the outcome of the smelt. Because maybe it burns hotter. Maybe ebony burns hotter than than oak does. Who knows? But I do know that the time is different. So like in a copper slate um, thing, copper slate furnace, the oak, hold on, I had the burn times down pat on the first one. Uh, no, I did not. Hmm. Oak has 17 seconds burn time inside a copper slate um, thing. And I don't even know if it's slate, because slate is like a light gray. So, who knows. Anyhow, let's go do some testing. Oh, did I have the filters on that entire time? Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. That's okay. You pr it probably looked okay. It probably looked good. Like, I can barely see in the world. I should probably be looking over there, shouldn't I? Yeah, maybe. Maybe a little. How long are we recording for? 13 minutes. Oh gosh. All right, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and turn off the filters just so it's regular, and the sun's about to come up, so. The sun comes up <clears throat> on Pro Jute World. Here we go. Um, oh, timer. Do not wanna miss the timer. So as soon as I start burning, here we go, ready? Oh, oh, burn. All right, I've started my timer. So there we go. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure that each one of these that pops out, I'm going to hit that lap button. And I have to keep a timer going. Or, yep. Yeah, you know what I mean. As soon as I hear the... I'm going to make sure that I have two wood in there at all times. There's one. 26 seconds and 30 seconds. Uh, 26.30. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. By the way, this may seem very boring to you guys. I love this stuff. Wait, did it just pop out? Go here. No. Come on, come on. And lap 27.53. The other thing that could be affecting this is differences in lag. Different connection speeds in between the client and the server. Different server lag speeds. Watch, I can probably call this. And pop. Pop. 
Ooh, 29.22. 29.22. So we've got 26, 27, 29 as our three differences in times. Not very consistent. Got to keep that burn going. Get ready for it. 26.97. Really close to the first time, which was 26.30. Come on, come on, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, oh, add, add, get ready, pop, there it goes, so that was 29.08, hey, 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 don't be jumping on my stuff, man, I'm making measurements, I'm making magic happen here, easy, 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 buddy. We're at 17, 18, 19, 22, 23, 24, 25, pop, pop, ooh, 30 seconds on the dot, Ugh. okay, are we stacking up over here, we are, okay, I got a little bit of time, I'm just going to go ahead and do this, add three, I'm going to pull these off to the side so they don't, Interrupt the flow. Get ready. We're at 20 seconds. Get ready for the lap. 27 27.94. 27.94. 27 27.94. So anyhow. If you've ever wondered how we get the measurements, how we do the averages and stuff like this, this is how it's done. Come on, come on, come on. Ooh, I was a little late on that, so it's 27 seconds. Which was about average to the, the last one, which was 27.94. Uh, that means this time that goes through, it's probably going to be a little short. Because I was late to hit the, the button. But that's okay. We're going to have a total time, which will help us out immensely. Oh, there we go. 27.02. Come on. Oh, add some. There we go. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Get ready for the pop. Four, five, get ready. Pop. There it was. 27.35. And now we've got two more. Oh, oh, oh. Add, add. Gotta burn. Gotta burn stuff. 15 seconds. 17. I hope you guys can see this okay. There we go. 22, 23, 24, 25. Get ready. Thirty-one seconds. Oh gosh. Add to the burn. We'll add one more and get ready. This is the last one. We're gonna hit stop instead of uh, instead of lap. Get ready for it. Eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. Stop. Five minutes and 38 seconds total time. Okay. So. Do, 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 do. Hi, Hunter. I see you. I see you. Oh, run away. Run away now. <laughs> oh, goodness. Okay, so. We can close this up. Oh, that was another thing. Um, I have not tested with doors open, doors closed to see if it makes a difference in the burn time as well. I mean, you could be losing a lot of heat inside the furnaces and Defaultio thought of that and programmed it that way. Maybe. Who knows? But that right there, uh, these are all copper. 
think these are copper. Are these copper? Yeah, these are copper. So, hi. Hi, hi, hi. These are all copper. And it was total of 30. I gotta go document this real quick. Uh, let's go to the sheet. Iron Appetite. Five minutes and 38 point. No, yeah, we'll just say five minutes, 38 seconds. About. And now I need to average it out. So um, I can bust out my handy dandy's blues clues calculator. And on the calculating screen, we're going to have five times 60, because there's 60 seconds in a minute. That's not going to work correctly, is it? Hmm. Five minutes. Uh, yeah, that's not going to work. Okay, Google. What is five minutes, 38 seconds divided by 12? The answer is approximately 28.167 seconds. Ooh, there we go. So Google's very smart about doing the calculations because technically you can't do regular calculations because it's using a base of 60. Where, okay, so like when you count numbers, it goes from one to a hundred, right? Well, when you get from one to 60 in seconds, then you flip back and it goes to zero and you get one minute because there's 60 seconds in a minute. Anyhow, that was, oh, my brain. <laughs> so what I could do is I could take um, five times 60 plus 38, divide that by 12. I wonder if that would work. Hold on. That would totally work, right? Where's my calculator? Is that my calculator? Here we go. Five times 60 plus, what was it? 38, 38 seconds. 338 seconds divided by 12, 28.16 seconds. Hmm. <laughs> that worked. Sorry for the clap. That was probably really loud. Anyhow. So that is our average. 28.16 seconds is the average of our logs. Now, if I go back to, sorry, not logs uh, of our copper. If I go back to the timer, all right, we can look at the times. 26.3, 26 26.9, 29.2, 26.9, 29.0, 30.7, 27.9, 27.7, 27.0, 27.3, 31.1. So it's, it's pretty accurate. The, that it's right there at the time that we set. So if you have, uh, and, and I can now make that as a measurement or a matrix against the other ones. So the gold appetite, this one here on the left hand side, right? It had a time of six minutes, five seconds, or an average of 30 seconds per copper. Now, this has about two seconds faster about 28 seconds per copper, which in my mind says iron is better than gold when doing the furnace. Now, I have not tested with the stones to make it sure that the stones don't make a difference, and the wiki's already testing that. The wiki is testing the stones, and we should have a matrix here pretty soon to tell you, but I wanted to make sure that you could see how to make these measurements on your own. You can go and make these assessments. You can, we're not just like picking numbers out of the air. We are actually doing the testing to uh, give you the correct answers. Um, what are we doing over here? So this one, let's see, four and four is eight. I can, I can absolutely, can, do we have time? Do we have time? We got about five minutes. Uh, if this takes longer than five minutes, that's okay. This is aluminum. Let's do the measurements of this one. I've already stacked it full of 12. Um, we can do a reset of the time. I can hit E and start at the same time and go. I'm gonna go ahead and add a second stone and we are off. Off to the races, my friends. Um, once we get to four, let's see. Six, once we've done six, um, then we need to kind of uh, keep an eye on it. 
What did I do? I, I went through basically all three stacks, didn't I? Oh, 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 lap, lap! Oh gosh, I hit that too, too late. 29 seconds. 29.85 seconds. Give or take a second. That, we'll, we'll go faster. I was sitting here talking the whole time. I was not paying attention, code. <laughs> Get ready. Ooh, lap. 29 seconds. Actually, you know what? Two. Let's see. Three, four, five. We can we can add some in here. Okay, we're at 17 seconds. So I can just do that. I don't have to worry about it. Get ready for the lap. Come on, come on. That one was 33.06 seconds. 33.06. Um, we can switch to two. I'm just going to pull these off to the side for a second. For a moment. For some reason, that, that is stuck in my head. It's a good old classic song, though. Oh, lap. 30.02 seconds. 30.02. So I can leave my stuff on it without it getting glitched everywhere. Um, cool. Do they have real windows in this game? No, only holes. Um, if you want, you can actually use a, a wood blueprint as a temporary window until there's something better to go in there. Um, you can also use, if you don't mind bars, you can... Oh, oh, 29.3. You can also turn a ladder sideways. Uh, I mean, it's not really that effective, but it kind of helps. <laughs> uh, I don't think closing the doors would have made any difference. Although, oh, ah, sorry, sorry, I missed that one. 28.83 seconds. I, although, okay, let's go ahead and add those. I'm just gonna close it because I'm I'm not sure if that makes a difference or not. We'll see if we, we changes the burn time or something. Get ready for it! Whoa! <laughs> What's up, Nick? Oh no! Did it get stuck? It got stuck in there. Thirty point oh one. <laughs> Hello. Hi. <laughs> hold on. I should probably tell him that I'm testing. Uh, hold on a second. Get ready for it. And... Hold on. Lap. There we go. 34 seconds. Hang tight a sec. I'm testing. And hi. <laughs> I didn't want to be rude, you know? There we go. Get ready. Lap. 29 seconds. Which way does the arrow point? I'm gonna have to add more wood, aren't I? Oh gosh, gonna have to add more wood. Okay, do this real quick. Go, open, one. Burn, burn. We're only at 19 seconds, so we're, we're good. Okay, okay, good, 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 good. Get ready, pop, 29.3. Twenty nine point three. Burn time is modified from the stones. Melt time is modified. Yeah, that's what we're testing too. Oh, 
Ooh, we're on the last one. That was 29.1 seconds. All right, on this one, I'm gonna hit stop. He also did all the medals, yeah. Okay, here we go, get ready for the stop. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Boom, 6.02. All right, 6.02. So let's go back over here, and the total time was 6 minutes and 2 seconds, uh, and I'm going to type out about. So if I was performing my calculations correctly, it was 6 times, hold on, 6 times 60 plus 2 divided by 12, which is 30.16 seconds. About 30.16 seconds. About 30 seconds. So that isn't very confident. That doesn't, that does not make me very confident about the gold versus the high body. Hold on, what are you doing? Stop, 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 stop. Let me pick these up real quick. I'm afraid of people walking on them and flinging them all over the place. <laughs> Lava takes the longest, but I use oak because it has a decent burn time and is common. That is true. It has about a 30 second burn time on, in Chamel's. Okay, there we go. How much copper did I get? One, two, three, four. I only got four stacks. Well, that makes sense because <clears throat> 12 and 12. 12 divided by two is six. So I got six out of that one, or I got two stacks out of that one, two stacks out of this one. And we're gonna continue testing, but we're, we are way past my time. So thank you everyone for watching this episode of Projute, Roblox Projute by Defaultio. With me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things we're supposed to call out at the end of the video. Uh, I'm going to get my numbers over to Soap. Um, to Sop. Sop. Small Soap. Scope. And so he can add to his testing. Dude, really? There we go. So he can add to his testing. Uh, I'm going to check with him, see how far along he is on his stones. And we're just, it's information for you guys on how to do the test, testing and measurements yourself to show you how we're testing and making those numbers happen for you guys. Um, that way you don't have to go and, and do the experiment and waste your time. You can go straight to the, the source of the best one that you want or the prettiest at this point. Um, iron is definitely, as of right now, faster than gold and aluminum. I don't know about copper and I don't know about tin. These are, are like more common, so I, you would think. But again, I don't know until we get the averages and get the actual times of each one. I do not want to trade with you, dude. You were just standing too close. I'm so sorry. Hi, buddy. Sorry. <laughs> uh, okay. Let me get out of here. Love you guys very much. Have a great night. We will talk to you very soon. <sighs> Outro. Thank you.